Today, guys, we have a £35 Pokemon mystery box. I'm actually super excited to open this. So, let's see how we go on. Hey guys, my name's Matt Cully and welcome to the channel. So yes, we've got a Pokemon mystery box to open, but first, a shout out to the first commenter on the last video, and that was pre-dawn Pokemon. Well done, man, you were the first one to comment on the last one. But I do want to give an honorable mention to Terry Wellard, who dropped a comment mentioning how I went a whole video talking about cursed balls and did not once make an innuendo, which actually I'm really surprised I didn't do that. And then that comment just made me laugh. So honestly, thanks for the comments, guys. Thank you to all of you. So yes, today though, we are going to go and open up this mystery box. It's a £35 mystery box. I actually don't know where it came from, but I do know that it was sent to me by Charlotte. Charlotte's actually my cousin, and she sent this in as a gift for me, and she sent a note which as an email, which I'm going to read to you now. Hi Matt, this mystery box is a little gift from me to you to help boost your collection. It's about time you kept some card for yourself. I also want to say a big thank you to your subscribers for supporting you. Fingers crossed we can work together and get you monetized by July. Hopefully. Thank you for the amazing content you provide in helping me keep sane whilst on lockdown, Charlotte. Honestly, Charlotte, thank you so much for sending this boxing. I'm super excited to open it up. And a massive thank you as well to everyone else that is supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. But I guess we should probably find out what is in this box. So let's rip into it. Right then, let us break the seal on this and see what is inside. So just a reminder for you guys, uh, if you haven't done it already, make sure you go and hit that subscribe button. We do monthly subscriber giveaways, charity giveaways, mystery boxes, live openings, all sorts on the channel. And uh, you do not want to miss out. Also, let's see if we can get to 50 likes on this video. That would be insane and I'd really appreciate the support. So go and hit that like button if you like the content, you like the channel and you want to help us hit that goal. Right. We are in. Let's, oh my, okay, oh geez. Oh, okay, everything just fallen out. That was interesting. Right, I'm gonna slide some stuff. <laughs> oh! Right, okay, look, here we go. Ah, okay, there is a note here. Thank you for purchasing, I hope you enjoy the box. Just, uh, just for you, leave positive feedback and message me best offer, blah, 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 to receive 5% off the entire purchase. Follow us on Facebook. Okay, so there's a little note about who is. I don't actually know who that is, but if anyone is interested, there's some details there for you. Uh, more appreciative to Charlotte for sending this through. So, she, I think she just found them on eBay. Let's have a little look what's inside. I was gonna tilt it up, but I don't think I can. Um, so we've got like a little boost pack. I don't wanna look, because I don't think, oh, okay, we look like we've got a special card. I might put that to one side. What we've got here, is this a little play map, or is it like rules? Unseen depths, theme deck, okay, interesting. Oh, okay, 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 we've got some booster packs. Let's get rid of these first. So we've got some cards there. We have some more, they look a bit better as well. Uh, maybe some trainer cards. So, a swag there we got, but that's another little bunch of them as well. We've got some booster packs, we'll have a look in a sec. We've got a couple more uh, sealed stuff there, plus, we have got this hard pack. So I'm gonna put those two at the back. Then we have these booster packs. So we have got plenty to open. So we've got one, two unified mines, and then a bunch of lost thunder sample packs. I'm not sure whether I actually wanna open them. I quite like the sample ones, maybe keep them sealed. Um, I don't know. Yeah, we might have plenty. We'll see, I'll leave them till last. We'll see what we get on. Plus we have that little Rowlet coin as well. Let's get this box out of the way. I guess we're gonna just go and crack through these really and see what's in these. I'm guessing these are probably a bunch of commons and uncommons, which aren't even up the right way. <laughs> Pinsa, Jesus, right, okay. Magic Carp, Magma, here yeah, we've got some, what's that? Evolutions, Electro Buzz. Uh, is that just, oh, Jesus. Right, and then Nidoran and a Nidorino to finish. So they put, oh okay, it's an uncommon at the back there. So, but this is wicked. I'm super excited to see, we've got the boosters as well, which is wicked, honestly. Charlotte, thank you so much for doing this for me. It is awesome. Lieutenant Misty, we love a Misty. Pokemon Center lady, a Sabrina's suggestion. What she suggested. Right, let's get in here. A Swack. Some names just crack me out. Uh, a Wiki. Oh well, look, there you go. The code card right there, enjoy. A shit, uh, shed ninja. Is that a slightly older set there? Talon flame. Nice. Oh, Natu. I like these designs actually. And a uh, Zatu there as well. So we've got some more. Let's fly through these. I don't know. We might have time. Maybe I will open the sample packs. 
Um, oh, we've got some uh, Wizard of the Coast stuff here, actually. I've just realised. Doi! Right, a doodle, a Pidgey. I love Pidgey, actually. Ratata, a potion, and a bill to finish as well. I do like a Wizard of the Coast stuff. Let's make it tidy. I would actually quite like to know, guys, what's your favourite set? All time favourite set. If you could have anything, what would it be? How have they set this up then? Right, okay. Let's just put that to the back. We've probably all seen what it was. Right, let's just flip some over. Uh, okay, so we've got some reverse holographics. A Poke Gear 3.0. A Cloister. Work out what set that is. I'm not sure. Lickitung. That's Unified Minds. And a Grook. Oh, it's Sword and Shield. That's what the set is. Right, so there's some newer stuff in here. Here we go, back to some Wizard of the Coast, guys. The one Squirtle. So classic, that artwork. So classic. Haunter, Ponyta, an Energy, and a Jinx. By the way, hopefully by the time of editing this, a lot of you should have... Oh, here we go. We've just fired off a holographic here as well. So let's see how this goes. We've got a Pyro. I'll mention the other thing. I said Pyro. Um, I feel like they should have put that towards the back, you know, but we're, we're gonna stick that back anyway. And Natu again, Executor fighting off all those is it Spearos attacking it. Interesting, interesting. And a Dustox to finish. Dustox? 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 I don't know, maybe I was saying it right. So there we go. So we've got one holographic out of this so far, but I guess we've got a bunch of booster packs. Now, we have two here sealed. Now, do I risk it? No, I tell you what, I'm going to save them until last and we're going to go booster packs. We'll do Unified Minds. I'll give all these code cards away, guys, so if you want these. Yeah, hopefully you guys that did ask for a sealed, uh, for a signed card from me. Hopefully a lot of you guys, if yours have turned up by now. Uh, and hopefully enjoying it. I was blown away by the response. I think I sent out like 30 odd in the end, which is insane. Um, needless to say, postage ended up being a lot as I sent some to Philippines, America, Canada, Spain, England, obviously, as well. It kind of all over the place. It's amazing to see where you guys are all around the world, right? Wimpard, a Bustle, a Basculin, and oh, there we go, a Mega Zone. So we've got another holographic. Ding ding. It's quite nice, actually. Quite a nice artwork on that. I know it's in the um, Sun and Moon series. There's a there's a race they do, and there's someone riding one of them. Okay, and then, yeah, stop. Right. Oh, look, this packet is so reflective that you can actually. I just saw what colour that code card is. I have a feeling it was green. So this could be a bit of a divey pack. Because Unified Minds does that, doesn't it? Green code cards, white code cards. Uh, Snorunt. A drill bar. Oh, I love that with the Moltres up there in the background. P Dove. What is that there? Uh, Rulio and. There we go. Like I said, Excalibur to finish there. Not bad. Right, one more booster here. One more Unified Mind. I don't want to see what colour the code card is. Thank you. I like the surprise. Enjoy these code cards get snapped up so quickly, but I never know what anyone's pulled. Who is the one getting those code cards straight away? I've got to know. Right, Kamala, Pokemon Research Lab, Cosmog, Magma, Cutney, Snowrunt, Tienamel, Dragonair, and a Sazzle to finish. We didn't get any more holographics. Hmm. What to do about these sample packs? Let's have a look. How many artworks have we got? I'll tell you what, I'm gonna keep two sealed and then we'll open the rest. How about that? Because now I've got, is that right? Have I got all the artworks? Yeah. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna keep these two sealed as I wanna keep the artwork and it's nice for my, I'm gonna start trying to collect some more sealed stuff and then we'll get into the rest of these. No idea how I should be opening it. Um, so let's just go for it, I guess, and we'll see how it goes. Um, oh, okay. Ultra Beast card list. Oh, okay, right. Marlow, Chansey, and a Treco. So, were we meant to do anything? No, nope, they're all on comments. Is that what the whole f sample set is? Do you actually, can you actually possibly pull a decent card in a sample, sample set? I'm sure a lot of you guys will know over me. That's another card list. A Poplio, Spinarak, and a, no, so far all comments actually. So, look, we'll see. 
like I say, I guess these are more, for me, I reckon they're more fun to just keep hold of, aren't they? Like seal. Yeah, look, common, common. And a common. Oh, that has got a face only a mother would love. Check out that. That is ridiculous. Oh, guys, however, you, how, hope you guys are doing really well and staying safe, by the way. I just need to say that. I feel like I sometimes miss that, and I just want to make sure you're all staying safe, you know, and everyone is well. That Volta artwork well, is really nice, actually. I know it's really tough, but hopefully, my videos are helping. I'm going to try and do a lot more live streams as well and get involved. Yeah, there we go. So they're all common. So, yes, I'm glad I'm keeping those other two sealed. Right, we are down to the final two cards. So we have this one that's in a hard sleeve which has two and then we have one on its own and i'm wondering which one is going to have the bigger hype should we leave the hard case to last and we'll go for this first and see if we have something decent here and we have a cypher reverse holographic that they try to surprise us with so a rare okay not too bad not too bad let's see what we get out of this one i'd say so far it's probably yeah just, the value's probably there it'd be nice to see Actually, I think I'm seeing a little flick of some color. Right, uh, how, do, how best to do this? I guess, do I like unsheath the one underneath first? Let's do that. And we have a Mega Sableye and Tyranitar GX. Beautiful card. I like a Tyranitar very much, actually. And uh, no, I'm a massive fan of this card, actually. I'm, I think I've got one version of it, not this one, but I love that. Okay, now, yeah, we're definitely getting our value up there now, aren't we? Especially with all the sample packs and those boosters. Ooh. Not bad at all. Right, we have one last card. Come on. And we have a Zora SV Shiny Vault card as well. I love the Shiny Vault cards myself. I think I showed the wrong one first, but never mind. Either way, I'm really, really happy with this. Some more great cards to add to my collection. I literally am struggling. <laughs> my collection has depleted somewhat lately. Um, so it's going to be nice to add a few cards into the collection for sure. All right, let's have a quick recap what we pulled. So guys, obviously we had all those sample packs, but we pulled that Mega Zone, that Pyro, which is actually really nice little artwork on this, I have to say. Uh, the Zora Shiny Vault and the best of the lot. This is my pick, guys, would be the Mega Sableye and Tyranitar GX. It's a beautiful card. Absolutely love it, guys. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed that. Uh, make sure to go and check out some of my videos up there. Remember, the subscriber giveaway and the charity giveaway are going to be going on later this month. You can go and donate now. Check out the links in the bottom if you want to enter the charity giveaway and help support the NHS. Other than that, hit the subscribe button up there. Hit some other videos over there. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe, guys, and peace.